Balenciaga multicolored fake shoe and wear it. But you now wear Gucci. You now wear fake Gucci. Fake, fake Gucci. <laughs> welcome back to my channel this is your first time of viewing please subscribe and to my previous subscribers thank you so much i really appreciate it. thank you for sharing and going, doing all the good stuff for me please do not forget to subscribe if you are yet to subscribe please give me a thumbs up drop your comment because this topic is about to be lit so on today's video i will be talking about beauty tips and tricks for the guys and for the ladies yes the guys are included because beauty is not just for the ladies for everybody you need to look confident and beautiful in your own skin so i'll be giving you guys some tips and tricks on how to do that and how to live a happy life well and time is coming guys so keep watching this video so the first thing is guys shave your beards tame your mane like you cannot just be carrying big beards up and just because you want to be beard gang and the rest you know when you shave your beard oil you comb it and it looks good everybody will be like attracted to it but can you just carry puffy beards and just be feeling like one oh, beard gang and you think <laughs> people are interested not all beard gangs are attractive so please tame your beards so the next point is shave your hair your pubic hair and men like you cannot just hug somebody and mm. in fact this is not just a guy thing ladies too please when your pubic hair is increasing you ampute hair shave it yeah, so please do your manicure take it seriously okay Secondly is moisturize some guys will feel like oh moisturizing and skincare routine is just for the ladies no it's not it's for everybody please moisturize your skin moisturize your face you know do it religiously so that you'll be popping you don't need to use filter <laughs> so guys don't forget that whenever you take your bath and you wash your hair don't just carry one regular soap or carry detergent because there are some people that use detergents to wash their hair powdered soap yes detergents they use it to wash their hair please stop it but then shampoo your hair there are different shampoos that are very affordable another point is lips see i don't know the, the, the thing that guys have with pink lips like every guy wants to have pink lips do not go and buy 500 pink lips on that bridge you know should you know should there be a keja do not apply to their lips. <laughs> their lips do not look swollen and their mouth look like baboon's bumbo. You know now, you know what they look like now. Like it's not even attractive at all, guys. Please exfoliate your lips. Yes, you exfoliate your lips and still look fine. If you have if you have dark lips, man, you can exfoliate that lips and still look chill. You don't need to carry pink lips and be looking like something else. That's not who you are. This is 2020. It's time to be you. Okay? It's time to be you. So please, you mustn't have a pink lips. Like, you I actually put this point as Balenciaga. Like, guys, I know that yes, everybody wants to trend. We have, want to have the latest store. We all want to have um, the Balenciaga, whatever trend clothes and the rest. But please, those ones I used to wear neon color Balenciaga outfit. I beg. I use God beg now. I don't know if it's the original or the fake one, but I beg. Don't they wear them again? Like, how will you wear neon color jacket? Balenciaga, this tribe Balenciaga everywhere. You now wear ripped jeans that they've ripped the light. Like, even a madam will say, Bro, you can have it. You now wear those two. You now carry multicolored shoe. I think it's also Balenciaga multicolored fake shoe and wear it. But you now wear Gucci. You now wear fake Gucci. Gucci wristwatch. You now carry cap. Those kind of cap that fishermen used to use that has rope. Yo, oh, you now wear it. And your mind. <laughs> your mind you're gonna train please don't come and be looking like posa color for us please just wear something nice you mustn't break the back please stop wearing balenciaga that is fake stop wearing that neon jacket it's very annoying please and this would like bling bling like what the hell it's not even original one <laughs> this is 2020 you have to change okay thank you why is that dog bagging so lastly for the guys drink lots of water yes so your skin will glow from within ladies don't we love guys that have glowing skin tell me the truth so now for the ladies let's start we have a lot to talk about like this 2020 things have to change first of all for the ladies our makeup 
this is where I come in because <laughs> it is what I do. What makeup is not for you. See me. Serious makeup like all those glammed up makeup. They don't fit me. I will look. I don't look like me, and I want to look like me because <laughs> who wouldn't want to look like themselves? If you cannot do your makeup, don't do it. <laughs> There are some things you can't DIY. Do you get? Like, if you can't do your makeup, don't do it. And if you can't learn it, pay someone to do it for you. It's better paying someone to do your makeup for you than coming out <laughs> looking like. <laughs> looking like. Please, I do not want color blocking on your face. Please. Another thing for the girls the brows. Like, you can't do these brows. Must you draw it? Just brush your brows and move. If you cannot, if you have a bushy brow, meet someone to trim it. Don't go to another video and drag your brow and, and trim everything. <laughs> Please, if you can't draw your brows, don't draw it. Be cool. Because sometimes you just go out looking like a scarecrow. And you think in your mind, you don't draw brows. <laughs> you now go out, you now go and highlight brow with concealer that is not your shade. Please, let's stop all those things. If you can't do makeup, go to YouTube. And learn there are different parties on YouTube that you can learn from please calm down Farida so another point is lashes girls girls come on there is a lash for every occasion like to be very honest it's not every lash you wear to church or mocks that you still wear for wedding and it's only the lash you wear for a wedding you still wear for a video shoot or a photo shoot or it's not the same lash you wear for a video shoot you wear for a date there are different lengths and sizes of lashes there are some lashes that are overly long maybe you have a video shoot you wear it for yes it's acceptable or a fashion shoot it's fashion but the annoying thing is that you know you have a very long lash that you fixed you know you know go and look for uber or taxify you now climb bike your eyes will not start flopping please let's stop that okay let's stop it <laughs> so another point girls is our mascara some of you guys don't take mascara seriously like you guys know that mascara is a very vital and very very important thing you know when you're applying foundation you are done with it you apply your powder there are going to be little particles that will drop on your lashes you will now go out looking like a farmer you are going to farm your eyes are now brown please mascara they are, they are very affordable ones just get it and apply do not forget to apply that mascara especially when you are done with your makeup you now fix a false lash and you didn't apply mascara it's not me showing you demarcation let me see two different roads <laughs> trying to meet <laughs> please let us stop that in this 2020 apply your mascara okay let's try to remember to apply our mascara okay thank you skincare should even be number one skincare is key i do not do my skincare regularly but skincare is key like when you do your skincare Honestly, you glow differently. There's no amount of foundation you apply <laughs> that will <laughs> that will make you glow, except you want to look like mud. But then, when you do your skincare regularly, your face begins to glow. You don't even need much foundation. Your face will glow. You know, exfoliate, clean, scrub, all those good stuff. Another point is, do not sleep with your makeup on i am very guilty because most of them i forget to even take off my makeup but if you remember it's better for you to sleep with your clothes on than your makeup on because this makeup they close the pores on your face your face will be able to like to breathe out do you understand they'll just be gathering inside your face and very soon blackheads aching will be there 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 pimples before you know your face is rough take off your makeup before you sleep it's like the best thing you can do for your face no to bleaching like i wonder why do ladies want to always bleach like <sighs> do you know how beautiful you are being black do you know like how beautiful an african woman is <laughs> changing your skin tone or your skin color because of mrs a is fair you too want to be fair it's not really the best choice for you so please no to bleach but if you feel you must bleach bleach with sense you cannot just bleach i'm looking like two different two different drinks coke and fanta so if you want to bleach maybe you are bleaching and everything your knuckles especially everywhere is even do not do cheap bleaching and if you're gonna do the expensive one don't bleach at all okay so another one is 
bronzer see this thing man this glue that everybody wants to have this glue i don't really know if we're already crazy about it, but really i do not like my bronzer to be pronounced please let us stop that act of cacking bronzers on our face honestly it is not cool let's stop excess bronzers and that thing is black eyes some ladies do not want to come out with their natural face because of they have these black circles here you understand they have this oh my god sorry for that they have these black circles on their eyes so they don't want to come out so anyways i found a remedy that i think should work so i wouldn't say to work for everybody but you guys can try it so you guys get tea bags tea bags lip thin top tea amity tea, whatever tea you use just soak it overnight okay get a hot tea cup soak it overnight then the next day put the tea bags on your eyes for 10 to 15 minutes then do it regularly my dear you see changes because i do have black circles before i had black circles before when i started doing the tea bag thing it worked so i pray and hope it works for you because not everything works for everyone so i pray and that thing is pimples ladies and pimples that's like one of our worst nightmares we don't want to have a breakout but it happens let's stop breaking our pimples okay because when you break them it brings about black head and spots so please let's endeavor to stop breaking our pimples exercise drink more water and mind your business so another one is sunscreen nigerian sun is not really favorable if you can get a neutrogena sunscreen spf 50 please apply it to save your skin from this torture <laughs> shave excess hair there's some ladies that have hair like here Please, it's not really cool when you go out like looking like that, trying to say you are hairy. <laughs> no one is in for that. So please, if you have excess hair like that, some people are very hairy, they have beards. Please try to shave it regularly when you can. Please, let's not go out looking like that. You know now. 2020. So guys, this is the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you've learned something. I hope you're going to change this 2020. You're going to be a better you. You're going to be you. Guys, you cannot just continue being someone else always be yourself and love yourself and take care of yourself because you are responsible for yourself so please guys do subscribe like my video give me a thumbs up come on drop a comment tell me your own skincare routine tell me how this video is if you love this video you want to see more of this thank you and thank you so much for watching bye guys